Mr. Koki Tanida from Tokyo University of Science. He will deliver his speech under the title of Be a Hero. Then Mr. Tanida, please come up to the center of the stage.
you must go to blood donation in advance for your important people. Please have slight courage. Please take the baby step forward. If so, you can become your people's hero. Also, you can help yourself, of course. In fact, if you donate blood, you can check if you can see if you're healthy or not by checking your blood testing for free and near your station. In fact, an elderly man realized the possibility of the end by checking, by checking it easily and he was able to escape from his death. So, your future if no future, need a young people's cooperation. If you do the activity for you, you all can build a strong foundation for the world where you can have medical treatment without any accident. The other day, I met one of the few people when visited blood on the center. At the time, I asked him, what do you do the blood? Then he said, Actually, my brother had kidney cancer, so I tried to give my kidney, but he rejected to my suggestion. So now at least I donate blood in order to enable him to have enough blood fusion when he has an operation. After that, I would become a hero. Helen Keller, as you know, who did her best for handicapped people once said, the most perfect person in the world is someone who has sight but has no vision. And when we do the best that we can, we never know what the miracle is brought in our life or in the life of another. She also noticed the importance of the action for the future. Ladies and gentlemen, please be a real brave. Please take a baby step forward for the sake of your vital people from now on. Let's be an admit together for everyone, including you. Thank you for listening. We have a question and answer period. Mr. Ebushi, please. Good afternoon, Mr. Tanida. Yeah, your turn. How do you feel right now? I'm very happy to um, deliver this speech. Uh, yeah. Okay, that's very good. Okay, my first question. Yeah. Why do you have to deliver this speech? Why do you have to? Okay. Um, um, in, um, that because uh, um, mainly a man I, I met in the blood donor center. In detail, um, um, naturally, um, I, in high school days, I went, I went to, uh, I blo donated blood twice. But after meeting him, um, um, I donated blood three in this year. So this is very, very nice event to um, donate to me to donate blood. That's because um, my parents are already fifty years old. Now I have all um, I have less to meet them. So now um, I feel a lot of times my parents' importance. So um, um, after um, entering university, I donate blood more and one more. Okay, that's very good. My second question is: How much amount of blood? are in short. Sorry, I can catch it. Sorry. Okay. How much amount of blood are in short? Um, in Japan or in the world? In Japan and in the world, okay. if you know. Okay. Um, in Japan, um, um, uh, sorry, um, um, when I am um, um, searching on the internet, um, I found that five, um, 50,000 
people are short of blood donors. So, sorry, um, I I can't um, understand the amount, but the number of the people who have concerned with uh, because of the shortage of the blood is uh, fifty thousand. Okay, 50,000. Okay, yeah. that's not a very small number. Okay. Next question is, I assume that you are very energetic towards blood transfusion. So I think you of course know where we can donate our blood. So please tell us the nearest place where we can donate the, our blood near this hall. Near this hall? Yeah, near the, the Tokyo Kaiyo University. Sorry, um, this is my university's case, but um, my um, the buses for blood donation would um, sometimes comes to my university, you know, in order um, because um, there are a lot of university students in the university. So maybe um, in this school um, there is a buses. Or there are buses uh, that come to this university. So you can um, donate blood um, sometimes, yeah. Okay, that's good. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you.